Beautiful. Look at that. Delicious. Hi, I'm Lisa and I'm from Botanic Region Victoria and today we're going to make my crispy pork belly. When my mum was alive, we used to go to Springvale a lot because you got all the Asian grocers there and um, she'd love to have the pork belly that was hanging in the windows and she said, oh Lisa, let's get a packet of that, you know, little container and I can have it when I get home. So, okay mum, no worries. So we get in the car. On the way home, she'd say, oh maybe I'll have a little piece now. And then a couple of miles down the road, oh, let's have another little piece. And by the time we get home, there's no more pieces left in it. That's how much she loved it. <laughs> so you're going to need yourself a really sharp knife or a box cutter, Stanley knife. And we're going to score into the skin, some nice deep lines. And you want to get right through it. If you go through into the fat, that's fine too. All right, pop it in a bowl. Pot upon some Shaoxing wine, some Chinese five spice, a little bit of salt, and a little bit of white pepper. So you just rub that in. And then we're going to turn it over. You've got to pop it into the fridge overnight so that'll dry out so you'll get the perfect crispy skin. Next step is to make a foil boat. So unravel some foil. My mother's name is Jeanette and she was born in Indonesia in Kutuwajo and she worked as a pattern maker and designer. She had her own shop in Wangaratta and she made all the dresses for all the ladies for the local um, uh, fashions on the fields and all that. And she had a little shop and she started working for big companies, Adidas, Lacoste and she designed the Olympic uniforms for the Los Angeles Olympics. When she passed away though, my sister said to her before she was passing away, Mum, what would you like to be remembered for? And she said, my cooking. That was my mum, cooking, you know. Now brush it with some vinegar. This also helps to make a really lovely crispy skin. And that's the best part of it, isn't it? and some nice rock salt straight over the top. So now we're going to pop it into the air fryer now and we're going to set it to 180 degrees for one hour. There's the magic. And now we're going to brush off all that rock salt and we're going to now pop it back into the air fryer to finish off. I actually never made it when she was alive and then when she passed away, um, my life became uh, more busier and um, I thought, well, I have to try and learn how to make this myself. So I came up with this recipe and that's how it all started. Oh, look at that. Perfect. Beautiful. Let's carve this baby up, huh? Mmm, that's what we want. Okay. Yeah, look at that. Oh, moist, juicy. Oh, fantastic. And can you hear that crackle? I'm going to serve it on this beautiful platter with some beautiful fresh greens, hoisin sauce, chilli and a lovely bowl of rice. So there you have it. This is my crispy pork belly. I hope you can enjoy it this time at Christmas. I'm sure my mother will be just as proud of it as I am. Merry Christmas!